Route 3 in Pennsylvania. And this is a magnificently pretty route. And uh, this is uh, a stop called the Lumberman's Museum. And I thought I'd uh, stop here. And it seems to be that there's a lot of antique cars going in here too. So we'll stop and see what's here. Little roadside scenery here. We'll just follow them up. So these are what I followed in here. Here's a Ford, a Nova, a Ford Matic, a Bonneville, a Chevrolet, a Le Mans, and a Chrysler Bel Air or a Chevy Bel Air. Nice looking cars. It's a, a small troop of, uh, I assume they're retirees, but um, they came in a group. Of, there's 15 of them. And uh, it's pretty cool. I don't really mix up with them, but. And let's see, here's the here is the uh, museum. The front is impressive. Um, so let's go in and we'll start the tour, I guess. Lumber Museum of Pennsylvania. Pretty cool. They don't use those saws anymore. They use band saws now. Figures the place would be made out of mostly wood. big thing. We're going to go down here first. American chestnut, which is pretty much gone from disease. Eastern white pine, which is almost taken care of. Black cherry, which there's still a lot of. The bears like that. And I have good furniture of that. Eastern hemlock, which didn't used to be used for lumber. So there's a lot of that. Sugar maple, which in my opinion it's a crime to cut down. An American beech. I don't know what they use beech for. I guess plywood. Some old chainsaws. We're gonna go into a movie for a minute. This is the uh, the introductory galley here. It's pretty neat. All the car people are in here. Sticky notes of things that they would like to see.
the stockade is a French thing. The water runs down instead of the English that did them horizontally. What does the name Pennsylvania mean? There's meaning to that, huh? William Penn, Sylvania. William Penn looks like a 14 year old boy. <laughs> Surveyor's compass. I believe GPS works a little easier now. There's one for you. It's the difference between timber and lumber. Timber means standing trees, lumber means cut trees. Can you see that? Probably not. There's letters in the wood, log stamps, to show who uh, cut it, who owns it. It's a very big blade. Notice the teeth come out. These teeth are not up in the cutting position. <laughs> They'd sharpen the teeth individually. Those are the hills. It's called cut and run. Cut the trees and slide them down the hills and leave the hills pretty much destroyed.
high tech surveyor tools. Surveyor's transit from Troy. Planometer. We use these. area of this. Sorry, I didn't bring the windsock. Um, but uh, I paid eight dollars for this, so I'm gonna walk around. Probably could have just walked in and gone around here without weren't paying for it, but what the heck. Who's a choo-choo train? Big choo-choo train? Choo-choo train cars? Wow. Look at this guy, big old tank car. Some of the tools. The Shea locomotive. Pretty cool. Focus in there. There you go. It's a big, uh, big tank engine. Kind of like Thomas, the tank engine. Cool. Got, uh, Tractor propulsion. Gears on the wheels. That's a different kind of choo choo. Still steam driven, of course. Go over here into the stable. There's the whole building. That's the new section and I guess that's probably the old section. I guess they work that train. They actually use it. That would be cool to be here when that was on operation. Stable in the blacksmith shop. Some neat stuff. Some sleds for winter moving logs. We've seen some movies of that in the Adirondacks. Little old wood stove still hooked up. This is the saw filer shop. Keep the saws sharp. It's a real art to know how to sharpen a saw. We've sharpened a few. The blacksmith shop, which I guess he works on certain weekends and stuff. They bring in a blacksmith to run the 
the fires and stuff. Would you like to be an anvil salesman? It's one of the jobs my father told me would be more fun than I could consider. <laughs> it's the carpenter's shop. It seems to be closed and locked. The sawmill seems to be closed. It is October 25th, so... <laughs> Got the windows uh, boarded up. It's kind of interesting. So let's see if we can get... Uh, get a better look from afar. There's a log holding pond and a sawmill and birch still. Trying to keep the wind off of you. It's a little breezy up here. Oh, and that must be what's closed is those stairs down there. That must be the real sawmill way down there. Bring the saws up that little chute. Float them around. There's a couple floating down in there. Uh, everything ran on either hydropower or steam. Water tower for the engine. It's a pretty neat little place. I'm not sure it's worth eight bucks, but <sighs> gotta support stuff like this, I guess. Down off the parking lot from the uh, the Lumberman's Museum is this original CCC camp from the Civilian Conservation Corps. And they, um, they grabbed it from wherever it was and redid it, rebuilt it here exactly as it was. And it was a chestnut cabin made out of chestnut wood, which, you know, chestnuts are not uh, around anymore. Um, and she was telling me that each one of these rocks is numbered so that it's exactly the way it was when they first got it. And this is pretty cool. We won't let the dogs go in there, but. So this is uh, <laughs> the CCC outhouse. <laughs> we won't take you through there. This is the switch, switch engine cabin. If you like choo-choo's, this is a pretty decent exhibit. And there's more old photos in here, historic photos and stuff on both sides. The nicely painted engine. What's this way back here? Locum staking machine. I don't think I can get that good enough to read. Well, you'll have to come here to see some of the good stuff. It's a pretty neat, pretty neat museum. She said it just opened a couple months ago and they're not really done. So, um, the whole back half of this building back half of this building um, isn't open because it isn't done yet so um, we'll have to come back 
this is a great area. Um, this part of Tioga County, I guess we're in. And uh, they even maintained the the shingles on the roof. I'm gonna go in here. We'll put the dogs on. Stay on the outside. Hey, sit. 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 Stay. Neat. Looks a little drafty. But there's uh, two bedrooms. Bedroom over there. Bedroom over there. How neat. Free. Okay, back to the car. We're done. <laughs>